right, what is going on YouTube? Today I'm going to show you guys how to actually and properly use the dagger in Deep Oaken. And if you're using dagger or planning on using dagger, you guys are in luck because I'm about to show you guys exactly how to use it. So yeah, a problem that I see is a lot of players use dagger at a distance. They don't exactly play super aggressive. They don't move as much, you know, maybe they'll throw out a parry and maybe do like a little roll behind them. Like, you know, being super aggressive is definitely the way you should use dagger. Mix ups, you know, roll cancels, all this crazy stuff, timing your hits. You know, dagger is a super strong weapon if you can use it right. Because dagger has such low damage, you have to work a lot more to get you know the consistent damage that you would from like a heavy weapon for example and especially in the current deep Bogan meta where everyone has you know 7000 hp and it's just impossible to kill anyone you really really want to change up your play style and start mixing stuff up especially with mantra cancels and tons and tons of roll cancels now i'll show some clips on the screen and these are clips where i am the aggressor if you're using dagger you need to be aggressive you need to be in their face at all times if you're not you're not using it right and you will lose like 80 percent of the time you need to abuse its swing speed because you know it is the fastest weapon in the game but the only problem is that its range is very lacking i don't know why deeper devs haven't nerfed the s key because Literally, if you just do this with like a heavy weapon or a medium weapon, especially dear God, Forgotten Gladius, with dagger, you just lose. So to minimize that chance, like I said, you want to go for heavy, heavy mix-ups. You want to go crazy with stuff like mantra cancels, faking audio cues, reading rolls and everything. You need to be doing all this stuff. But if you want to start winning all these games, this basically really is the only way, especially in the current meta. When layer two drops, I don't know if it'll be easier because I do know the parry window is going to be a lot smaller. So maybe dagger will be stronger, but you know, current deep Pokemon right now, daggers, in my opinion, are super weak, especially compared to everything else. I guess you could say like in the meta right now. The next thing I'm going to go into is choosing your mantras. Mantras are a super important part, especially in the dagger playstyle that i'm talking about because if you are going for mix-ups and reads you want to have like not exactly mobility mantras but mantras that you know move you forward mantras that can give you space um and close the distance so things like gale lunge ice lunge or whatever it's called flame assault thunder assault rap punches you know stuff like that all those are really good and definitely things you want to take but yeah i would say that's pretty much it um you can learn some more from the clip i do encourage you guys to pick up dagger and try this playstyle because it is super fun and you feel so much more mobile than than ever before 